So this is our new mobile chicken shed that Nellie and Rupert have been super busy with building over the last um, few weeks and months. We had a materials um, delay. We didn't know if we were going to get it done in time because of coronavirus, the factory's all shut down. Um, but um, this is in line with our regenerative uh, approach, trying to understand how to do regen chickens. So we have a caravan chassis, so they smashed the caravan off, um, and built this. Um, so this is, although our current sheds are mobile, uh, we only move them every flock, so every 72 weeks or so, um, which means the ground does get quite um, poached around and also there's not fresh stuff for the chickens to eat every day. Whereas this shed will move every day. Um, these are the nest boxes, roll away nest boxes with AstroTurf, same as usual. Um, this is the uh, excluder. Uh, eggs will come into here so we can collect those um, so it'll be a little bit more manual because we won't have a belt um, this is all perching so the black stuff is just tar paint to protect, protect the wood a bit but you see perching goes all the way from the floor all the way up to the ceiling um, and the shed will move uh, every day so every day the chickens will have fresh grass um, insects etc to eat and all the muck uh, drops straight through the floor oh sock and sandal combo there you can see i'm sporting today um and with all the muck will drop through the floor which means it's nitrogen going straight back into the ground and phosphorus etc um straight away we also have uh nelly and rupert's design of a grit feeder here so um these will they're in their transit mode at the moment and then they will drop down uh, I don't want to break it, Nelly is too mad if she sees me breaking it. And these will drop down, um, which means that the birds can then get the grit. Uh, the animals, the birds will be fed and watered outside, uh, which is new and different. And we, we will learn how that works and what that looks like um, in time. Um, so it's all ready to go. Reason one, uh, pop holes are here. 